just how the hell am I supposed to make a nice shot from these conditions? Well, stick with me and I'll tell you. In fact, what's more, I will show you. First thing first, wake up, tidy up, pack up, saddle up, drive out to the beach, cursing every weather forecaster in New Zealand who said today was going to be 30 degrees, hot, sunny, beautiful, which would be perfect for my chosen location. Not to be. We're clagged in. We've got intermittent rain bands coming through. It's nowhere near 30. It's more like 24, but it feels like sort of 22 with a wind chill factor. Wind chill, not so much a factor, but you know what I mean. So we have got to try to make a cracking shot from these conditions. And I'll tell you what, we are going to do it. We're going to go from headland to headland on the push bike, scout out some locations. We've got heavy rain coming in tomorrow. This is about as good as it's going to get today. So to make a shot, what are we going to do? I'm going to chill out through the day. And then this evening, we'll head down to the beach to the chosen location, set up the camera on a tripod, and we're going to shoot blue hour over my chosen subject, Timotu Okura, the island of Kura, locally known as Bear Island. And on a gorgeous, shimmering, hot, sunny day, that island Island stands out like dog's balls. Not today, but I do promise you it's going to look spectacular this evening. I hope. Now, just up the beach, there was a couple of fishermen on the rocks, so that's a couple of guaranteed photographs in the bag. The slate grey sky is making way for this. We're gonna get some nice black and white drama. A simple shot, but quite effective. Very effective, actually. We need a little bit of foreground interest. I was gonna head back to the rocks, but I think this is gonna be even better. A stream outlet, it's gonna be quite nice. And this is the southern headland. This is as far as I'm going, or as far as I can go. Look at this. That's the target there. I think that could make a shot. And amazingly, the sky's starting to break up a little bit. So uh, there's hope. Ah, what a beautiful place. Well, the sun's come out just in time for golden hour. Oh, can you believe it? Unfortunately, <laughs> the tide is in, so the rocks that I fancied using as foreground interest, they've gone. So what I've decided to do, come down to that stream outlet, just get a few shots from down here. I'm just using these small waves coming in to act as a bit of a leading line out to the island, and it's working really, really nice. Just a real quick word on the camera that I'm using. The Leica Q2, of course, 28mm lens, amazing camera. Doesn't really matter about the camera, it matters about what you can see, the settings you choose, and making the shot work. I think you can use an iPhone to get a shot like this, to be fair. And that sunset, some nice pastel colours in there. Quite a slow shutter speed now, something like about a tenth of a second, so we get some movement in the water. Right, so we're about maybe 10, 15 minutes away from blue hour. So at the minute, eight seconds, F11, ISO 100. It's looking really good. So right now, the camera's doing a 20 second exposure. Fifty-second exposure with long exposure noise reduction that you can't turn off. That becomes a 100-second exposure and two-second self-timer. So that is 102 seconds to take one photograph. I hope it's worth it. 